Welcome to the opening fixture of this season's UEFA Europa League. So a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. A delight to have him on board. Thanks for that, Peter, and may I say a big hello to everyone. There is the anthem, the familiar precursor to this intriguing contest. the lineups we've just been given.
the whistle. Who's going to make this theirs? Well, there's no way I'm accusing him of being selfish, Peter. He had no support. Now it's Chilhanolu. Now it's Vinaldum. Vinaldum plotting from out on the right hand side. And he's there to hoof it away. Klein. Wonderful quick feet. Chalanolu. Header! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. Liverpool had players queuing in the box in that situation, and they've still got nothing to show for it. What a complete and utter waste. Well, that should set them on their way and get into a nice rhythm. The early signs are very encouraging now. Klein gathers from the goal kick. And it's Origi. Raspilicueta. Firmino. Now here's the through ball. Mamadou Sacco charges in. Aspilicueta does well there, alert. Matip. Jordan Henderson tries a long pass towards the front. Aspilicueta tries a through ball. Roberto Firmino looking to get on the end of this. Nicely controlled. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. And he has been fouled there. Simple finish in the end, what do you think, Jim? I just think it's clever positioning from clever movement, and when all of that is synchronised with the right pass, that's what happens. RZ, draw first blood here. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Place it out to the wing. Some good play on the left-hand side now to profit from it. And it's Vinaldum. Jordan Henderson. Vinaldum. Vinaldum! And he nearly went all the way. And it looked as if he had Hollywood written all over it, but it ended up in bust, unfortunately, on this occasion. What a pity. That's not going to make it. Mamadou Sacco is the route one option. Firmino. Now the pass. That'll be a throw in. Milner hoisted towards the area. He was well picked out, just needed a better finish. Well, by crossing the ball so quickly, I think this defence just can't get set to deal with it. I think deserved a better outcome than what we saw. But, um, Worth exploring more. Up for the header! What about it? They are right back in business. A wonderful delivery, and all it needed was a touch. 
Well, look, it's it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle. But that was beautifully met. It really was. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. Good clearance and very necessary. Looks like a good ball through. Now here's the through ball. Mamadou Sako is proven to be the best ball winner in the side. Origi with the ball through. Now it's Roberto Firmino. Really didn't have enough to concern the defence. Out to the left it goes. Matip battles to win it back. Aim forward. Wijnaldum looking to get on the end of this, and he's kept it out. Oh, great save, real class. Well, I can only add that he's got reflexes that are in perfect working order, Peter. That was very good to watch. Up to meet it! It goes to show he is human after all. I think he's done very well to get into such a good position in front of the goal, but he just couldn't put in the telling touch. Boom forward, passes it through, now here's the through ball. Rest de I think that's offside, yes it is. Ties lifting it over, well positioned to make that interception. Klein. And he's made certain that won't get through. Now it's Roberto Firmino. And it's Aspilicueta. It's come loose. Fence has got rid of that. Well, he was never going to miss from there. Well, for me, that's just pure predatory brilliance. It's not so much the finish, but the way he read the situation when nobody else was even alert to it. It's fantastic. Referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. So we reach the halfway point. Oh, what a half, it's, it's been pulsating and totally absorbing. We're actually headed for a, a potential classic if this carries on. This is insanely good. Very little in it, the score at half-time is two goals to one. Firmino. Oh, that's neat. to get it forward quickly. That's the throw. Jordan Henderson. Firmino. Fine Alden. Klein lobs it in gently. Jordan Henderson. Firmino. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. 
Yeah, you can certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. Cuts it out. Looks to thread it through. Origi is being picked on here. Yeah, and the fact that he's registered, Peter, simply encourages more attention of, um, of a, a closer nature. That'll be a throw. Played into the middle. The shot's on! Keeper's not concerned by that. Long and forward. Vinaldum has made his mark on this game. And it's Chalhanolu. Looks to slip it through. Klein. Chalhanolu. Plays it backwards and they'll try again. Roberto Firmino plays it out to the wing. Have to say that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Out to the left it goes. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire a commitment like that, because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing, but instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. Now the cross. Well, we don't need to guess that they expect plenty of, of ball into the box. <laughs> it's quite a crowd scene in the middle now. Well, it's a situation that requires resilience now and, and plenty of fighting spirit. It has to be matched. Wijnaldum gets his foot in there. Yeah, that's put paid to a promising move. They've managed to get it away. So what now? Firmino. And the finish! And that would have won it. Oh, it should have been the clincher, Peter, and he'll be kicking himself for not taking the pressure off. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Vijnaldum. Come back to the keeper. Matip. Milner. Raspilicueta. Now it's Roberto Firmino. Good idea, just poorly executed. Goes long. Now here's the through ball. Should have equalised. Well, he won't need telling what a big chance that was. The look on his face says the lot. Final checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. Sane is making here his first appearance since signing on loan. Jordan Henderson, who does have an assist to his name. Origi. Plays it out to the wing. Long and direct. Place it over to the other flank. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. The ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Well, with him already been on a yellow, he should know much better than that. He hits it! No, not quite. A 
Just a few more moments for them to hang on. Sané. Dinks one in. Whipped in. Sticks it away! And surely that clinches it! There really is no way back now! What about that, Jim Beglin? Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. When the manager called on him, he was only too happy to repay that faith. Well, the instruction from the manager would have been go on and make yourself a nuisance and see if you can snatch a goal. Mission accomplished. Two up and very little time left. Surely this is it. Matip positions himself well and cuts it out. And that is it, the referee has seen enough. Well, that's the way to launch the campaign. Now they can look ahead with confidence and comfort. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Well, they've laid down a marker with such a good opening win, and they're saying to the rest of the...